Kate and Leia here. We're from Walking Mountains, and we are out and about learning about how animals can hide in plain sight. Camouflage? Oh, like what hunters wear. Yeah, but nature did it first. There are so many animals that are able to blend into their surroundings. Let's play a game. Can you find the seahorse? There it is, hidden in the coral. How about this one? Here's a hint. It's an owl. There it is. Okay, even harder. There it is, hiding in the leaves in plain sight. I think this one is the hardest one of all. Can you see it? Yes, it's a caterpillar. So those animals match their environment. Like an owl lives in a tree, so it matches the tree. But what happens if the owl moves somewhere else and the trees look different. So animals can blend into their environment because they've lived there for hundreds and maybe thousands of years. So their coats and feathers are perfectly suited to match that particular environment. If they moved, then they wouldn't match their new environment. But there are some animals that are adapted to change based on the seasons. Can you believe that these are the same species of bird? One is in its summer feathers and the other one is in its winter feathers. Can you guess which one's which? Yup, the one on the left is summer and the one on the right is winter. So I understand that animals can blend in and camouflage, but why do they camouflage? Well, wow. have you ever had a moose burger or owl nuggets? Oh, I've had a moose burger. That's pretty tasty. Okay, I see. So animals blend in so that way they don't get eaten by predators. That's right. And predators blend in so they can sneak up on their prey. Oh, that reminds me of a game. I love games. So to play this game, you need at least one other person so siblings or parents can play. And, most importantly, you need to be outside. Now, one person is going to be the snowshoe hare. That's like being it. Everyone else is going to be predators. Can you think of a predator that might eat a snowshoe hare? Me, 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 me. You're right! A coyote eats a snowshoe hare. So, the snowshoe hare is gonna cover their eyes and count to 20 really, really slow to give the coyotes time to hide. After counting to 20, I'm gonna look around. I can't move from my spot because I don't wanna get eaten by the predators. Now, if I see anyone, I can call their name and they know that I found them, and they have to come stand with me. The last person hiding is the winner. If you have a tie and two people are still hiding, whoever is closest to you is the winner, because that is the animal or the predator that would be the closest to eating the prey. Now where is Leia? 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 I can't find her! There she is! Man, how did I not see her? Looks like Leia took a lot of tips from nature. The colors she was wearing matched the tree that she was hiding behind. She was very, very still. 
and didn't move or wiggle, and she was very quiet. Do you think that animals in the wild do this? Now that you know how to play, head outside and give it a try.